we have looked at the synthesis that is going to give us what palmitoyl will be. We have looked at the synthetic pathway, and then we stress on the fact that should that palmitate undergo any reaction in the body, it has to be active as the addition of what the coenzyme A. Now, there are fatty acids in the body that would, are longer than what cysteine count. So, how does the body achieve that? Body achieve that. Now, there are things we need to note. The body only adds most of the times a maximum of what? Two what? Carbons. A maximum of what? Two carbons. So we have an 18 carbon fatty acid that we obtain from what? Palmitol Kobe, which uh, we've come to know as what? Steric what? Acid. Steric acid, that's 18 carbon. Now, this elongation that we are talking about, it occurs in two places in the body. Either it is within the endoplasmic reticulum, endoplasmic reticulum, or it is what's located, it's happening in what the mitochondria happening in the mitochondria. So this addition of the two carbons, most of the, the extension are limited towards two carbons. And then for me, steric acid, either okay here or here, where we have what fatty acid was, the longuses, fatty acid, the longuses, they ensure that what there is addition of these two carbon units to fatty um, acids. This fatty acid power it all we so that we can form the steric acid or the palmitic acid from steric acid. Now let's also, um, sorry, let's look at this saturation. This saturation is just yes, uh, introducing and saturation into the fatty acid, and we are looking at introducing double bonds. Remember that doing, we are introducing double bonds. During the synthetic path, we, we looked, we saw some carbon-carbon double bond, but later on, due to reduction, they were removed. Now, should the body form an unsaturated fatty acid, it does this by introducing what? just one, so the body can form an unsaturated fatty acid, having just one bond, um, double bond. Now, other things may happen. If you want the body to form a poly unsaturated fatty acid, then two substrates are needed from diet, sanal sources. You either need linoleic acid or you need linolenic acid. These two are precursors to formation of what you feel in the body should have to them, polyunsaturated fatty acid. But what we, we are seeing here is that from palmitated, the body can only what? introduce just one double bond. And it is very specific. The enzymes that do that, we call them the desaturases. The body will only introduce double bond at either carbon number four, five, six, or nine. So um, let's, take, let's take this. For palmitic acid, right? There is an enzyme called the delta 9 desaturase. Delta 9 desaturase. So does it do? It introduces what a double bond into the palmitic acid or carbon number nine. So delta nine. And then that compound is what the palmitoleic acid. We talk about 
extension, right? Addition of two carbons, where from palmitic acid, we can have what you call steric acid. So this steric acid is 18 delta zero, that's 18 carbon, zero double bonds. And then we end up with what we call the oleic acid. This oleic acid has what? 18 carbons with one double bond. That one double bond is also on carbon what? Number nine. So it is also being acted on by what? A delta nine what? D saturates. So these enzymes, the desaturases are very specific for the position that um, the double bond should be introduced. Carbon four, five, six, or nine, no other place, no other carbon that the double bond can be introduced. The extension is what limited to what two carbons. This saturation or introducing what those double bonds what, is limited to positions four, five, six, or nine. And the enzymes are very, very specific for, for those positions. I also may mention the fact that the human body can only do what? Mono unsaturated fatty acids from the palmitic acid that we synthesize. But should the body be, be required to do, to form pufes so or the polyunsaturated fatty acids, it cannot be what formed from palmitic. But we need two what substrate, any of this, a linoleic acid or a lino what, linic acid. The body can what act on this and produce what polyunsaturated fatty acids from them. <laughs>